What's up, y'all? Welcome back to Miller's TV. Um, another day back at work, which I wasn't going to do a vlog or nothing and, you know, bore y'all. But, as you can see, what's back up on the lift again. I think my dad has a bad spending problem on this Jeep. But here's what he got now. I'm kind of, it's kind of upside down. But anyway, it's a rear bumper from Smitty Built. As you can see, it's got the brackets here and here. It's a, also got a swing out for the tire carrier to get the tire off the tailgate. And there's the swing out. So as you can see, you get this here. It goes on your pin. And then up here's where you bolt your handle and your latch, which goes on this end. Which is kind of hard for y'all to see it because it's upside down. Let's see if I can get a better view over there for you. Yeah, there's somewhat something. So now we're going to start tearing this factory back bumper off. We got to get the bumper off. Got to get this old grease hitch off. Spare tire, all this stuff out of the way, which is kind of self explanatory. So I don't know how much of that I'll film. And then we'll show you, start putting that bumper on. We got the rear bumper off, which is basically just a piece of plastic. Yeah, it's right over there. That's just basically useless. It's got no metal in it at all. It's just plastic. Except for the end cap. It's got a little bit of metal bracket that bolts to the frame. So four bolts and it's off. And then we, I've done undone the spare tire. And now I'm out to undo the spare tire carrier. And get it off the tailgate. And then we'll put the bumper and the tire carrier that I showed you a while ago. Okay, we got the bumper in place. It's kind of everything just... The bolts up snug, which it says not to tighten everything, torque them down or anything yet, but got the tire carrier in place, uh, the handle in place working, went ahead and got it tightened, uh, got the bolts in the tire, I mean in the reach hitch, and they're in place so we can get everything lined up and level, and I've got the, the tire carrier brace just in position, we've still got the bolt, put bolts through here and here down into the bumper and then still got to put on the actual tire carrier brackets here and the third brake light but it's coming along i'll show you a few show it to you again in a minute all right guys we finally got the rear smitty built <clears throat> xrc bumper put on there it is uh didn't show all the tightening of the bolts and stuff it's kind of boring but Anyway, it's kind of simple. We've got two bolts on each end under there. <clears throat> Four across where the trailer hitch is. Uh, trailer hitch mount and two on this end. And then you have two two bolts that go in here once you get the tire carrier adjusted. But, uh, yeah, I think it turned out okay. You can pull that up and, and lock it. Actually, I got it locked now, I think. Swing and spin her out. There you go. Uh, that rubber bushing right there is it's because it's new, it's really real tight. But you can lock it back until it keeps from turning when you're trail riding or something. But I chose not to put the third brake light back on it. I like the looks of it better without it. Alright. There it is. Smitty bit built XRC rear bumper and tire carrier. All right, until next time.